Bullet Train was a demo that we made to help show off the brand new Oculus Touch motion controllers. Robo Recall was an initiative for us to take what we learned from Bullet Train and turn that into an actual game. In Bullet Train, we came up with the idea of teleporting around, but there was still a very specific spot for the player to be. So in Robo Recall, we have a new movement mechanic that allows you to teleport around fully unconstrained 360 degrees around the environment. Virtual reality is huge for us at Epic, and we've made countless improvements to the engine over the past year, very specifically targeted at the best performance and the best visual fidelity. On Bullet Train, we used temporal anti-aliasing on the deferred renderer to create a really nice, stable, soft image. But one of the issues with that was that it lacked a little bit of clarity. For Robo Recall, we've moved to a simplified forward renderer where we can use MSAA to, to have the sharpest, clearest image quality that we possibly can. With our VR titles, since we don't necessarily know what works because VR is so new, we have to try everything as fast as possible. And with blueprints and visual scripting, we can have many more people than just programmers try out and iterate on ideas really quickly. To be able to go from, hey, that sounds cool, to, yep, it works, we verified that it's great, let's move on, we can do that in one sitting. And that's the power of Unreal.